I think it's exciting that we're starting to have this conversation in a company director's context because when you think about millennials, you're talking about uh, an extraordinary generation coming through in terms of sheer size, but also in the significant way that they're looking at the world and the issues around it. What we know is that they're bringing a totally different and new perspective to the way we build businesses, to the way we build economies, and to the way we participate in our own communities. I think change is happening more quickly than ever. There's a, definitely an acceleration in terms of what boards need to address and how they need to adapt their, their strategy for that. They have been interacting with technology and the, and the opportunities that it provides from a very early age. And that gives them a different mindset as to how they approach the risk associated with that, but also what they can gain from it having that diversity of thinking, different skills, different experiences, different backgrounds. It's really, it's all important. I don't think you can just focus on experience. Definitely experience is very, very important. Like you can't look past that, but that's how you structure your board to add value. They're a generation of digital natives. They communicate with one another differently. They're very used to picking up a new thing and learning it you know, within the space of a couple of hours and completely uh, making what they were pro previously using for service delivery obsolete. And therefore, when we think about the boards that are guiding the new age of business, both at the top end of town and the biggest corporates, right the way down to the startups that are going to turn into the future ASX 200 leaders, we need to have boards that represent that future, that bring together a diverse range of perspectives and that tap into the creativity, the energy and the different perspectives of a younger generation.